Autumn is a great season to tour Europe if you are looking for romantic destinations, colorful foliage, and warm comfort food. While winters can be dark and cold, autumns are just a bit chilly and moderately rainy. Moreover, from October to December, we are off the high tourism season. Many places have more convenient fares and are less crowded, allowing more relaxed touring and better Instagram pictures. Welcome back to Town Travel Tips. In today's video, we are going to discover some of the top three incredible places to visit in Europe during autumn. We will look for beautiful foliage in romantic cities and take advantage of the weather to make the perfect weekend getaways. Remember to like the video and subscribe to the channel if you are a curious traveler and want to learn more about beautiful towns and traditional recipes worldwide. Have you already done that? You're handsome. Let's get into it. Number 1. Turin Turin is a super romantic and decadent city in northern Italy. It has been the Italian city capital until 1860, and the royal past can be clearly felt walking in the central squares. Moli Antonelliana, the city landmark, dominates the elegant buildings and looks straight to the Alps, as close as 50 kilometers from Turin, and an ideal day trip for mountain lovers. In autumns, Turin shines beautifully, with the Lungo Po, a walk right on the edge of Italy's major river, turning yellow and orange with breathtaking foliage. In case of rainy days, Egyptian Museum is the most relevant museum in the city and showcases the most significant Egyptian collections, mummies included, outside El Cairo. A couple of hours there will bring to you ancient times, pyramids and pharaohs, all of this without moving from the very heart of Turin. Hot chocolate and traditional Italian cuisine will be your comfort food while wandering the main streets, and when you get bored of the city, there are two great options for a quick detour. If you love snowy mountains, the Alps are your destination. Head to the Via Latte, which means Milky Way in Italian, and you can probably guess why. The Western Italian Alps sparkle like the sea of stars in our galaxy in the bright night sky. It is approximately 70 kilometers from Turin, and includes the Piedmontese resorts of Clavier, San Sicario, Saas d'Alks, Pragulado, and Sestrier, as well as the French resort of Montgenever. There are approximately 400 kilometers of skyable terrain, 120 of which have the artificial snow and 70 lifts. The winter season opens officially in late November. Still, the alpine foliage is a great reason to go there even before. If you prefer the Italian countryside's vibe, UNESCO listed the Lang region is the place to be. Alba, the world capital of truffle, will treat you with unique Piedmontese dishes with freshly cut truffles like Agnolotti or Taglierini. Barbaresco and Barolo are produced a few kilometers away if you love wine. Most vineyards can be visited with wine tasting and spectacular dinners on hills fully covered by grapes. Number 2. Barcelona If you are lucky, autumns in Barcelona will not be so different from late summer. The weather can still be warm under the positive influence of the Mediterranean Sea. In addition to spectacular architecture, beautiful golden beaches, and world-class art and culture, Barcelona has a fantastic culinary scene. The city has over 1.5 million residents and a definite Mediterranean vibe that you will fall in love with. From October to December, fewer tourists will crowd the main sightseeing spots, and prices will be pretty lowered compared to the summertime. Visit the Sagrada Familia, the Antoni Gaudi masterpiece still under construction but already a UNESCO-listed site. Construction started in 1886 and hopefully might be ended by 2026. The outside is stunning. It does not blend with the city's architecture in the area, and it is impressively big compared to the buildings all around. Inside, the magic colors of the cathedral's windows shine bright like a rainbow, and the tall roof and giant columns will be well worth a visit. After the Sagrada Familia, you should have a look at the city from above. For many years, the Montjuic cable car has been the most unique method to see Barcelona's beauties. Its 750-meter walk offers breathtaking views, culminating in the Montjuic Castle, perched on a mountain that embodies the city's living past. Enjoy Barcelona's iconic landmarks, including the Sagrada Familia, Camp Nou, and the long beaches by the sea. Barcelona will be at your feet. After this experience, head to the shore and explore the city's old town, the Barceloneta. The Barceloneta area is an old fisherman's neighborhood, and today are plenty of traditional restaurants and street food strolls. Typical Spanish dishes will be your comfort food against the wind that might gust over the city. Still, we are sure that easy tapas like patatas brava and bombas will quickly turn into your favorites. Number 3. Edinburgh Edinburgh is the regional capital of Scotland 
and one of the most charming towns in the world. Even if the whole city seems stuck in the 1600s, Edinburgh has all the services you can need or want, the warm and welcoming Scottish people, and a unique balance between medieval and modern times. In autumn, it shines for the spooky castles and architecture, and for the event-packed season. In October, the build-up to Halloween will not go unnoticed in every street and shop. From November on, it will be already Christmas time, and the city will dress up with shiny colors and lights. While the weather can be cold with snowfalls in November and nights will be prolonged due to Edinburgh's latitude, the happiness of Scottish people, the local craft beers, and the Scotch whiskey will keep you warm. The castle that dominates the city is definitely worth a visit. Among historical pieces, it holds the jewels of the British crowns, fabulous diamonds and items and more. Visit the old area of Dean's Village, a magical place that looks like coming straight from the 1600s or from Harry Potter books. Do not mislead the fisherman's village in the north by the sea. Very windy but so authentic. Have fish and chips on the shore and head back to the city for a guided tour in the Highlands region, home of many ancient and still working distilleries from where the famous Scotch whiskey is produced. Edinburgh's charm will be forever in your heart and you will likely come back for more of one of the best European destinations. Are you planning an autumn trip to Europe? Do you want to visit its romantic landscapes and immerse yourself in stunning cities and little towns? Comment below with your dream destinations and do not forget to like the video. Subscribe to the channel and if you want more suggestions, check out our 48 hours trip plan to Milan at the link below. Thank you. See you in the following video and in the meanwhile, ciao.